What's happening, everyone? Jay Shock Blast here, and check it out. As you guys know, I am sponsored by Elgato, and they have been a fantastic partner to work with. One of the things that I have been most excited about and happy about to have in my Elgato suite is this guy right here, the Elgato Wave 3 microphone, which pound for pound is literally the best microphone on the market. I have this beautiful blue uh, anniversary edition that I bought with my own money, even though I probably could have asked them to send it to me. But I believe in the product so much that when they had a limited edition, I had to have it. I, it, I love seeing it in my videos because everybody has the black one. I got the black one right there. I've got another one in the drawer because I can't find the stand for it. That was my beta unit. I've had this microphone since it was in beta. I even have the even rarer, super rare, right here, Elgato Hot Pockets microphone, which you could possibly win monthly by going to 120.gg and just telling them why you deserve uh, to, to win their Hot Pocket prizes. Uh, you can win a whole suite of packages and prizes. So that's neither here nor there. You guys know why you're here because Elgato recently came out with a game changer. As you know, XLR microphones are the best. Like they are going to give you the best fidelity, the best sound, everything. Uh, so, so much more than you can get out of a USB microphone. Although this one right here is as good as it gets as far as I'm concerned. Um, but now we have this bad boy right here. This is the Wave DX. It's $99. You can get it now. It's available now through Elgato um, and anywhere else you buy your Elgato gear. Um, you can get it on their website right now. There's a great bundle. Now, the thing about uh, XLR, this is an XLR microphone. The thing about XLR microphones is you need a mixer, okay? And they've got a solution for that too. Right here, you have the Wave XLR. It is just a single mixer that you can connect a single microphone to. Um, this is a pro mic. This is the type of mic uh, that you're gonna see in multi-microphone setups, through mixers, all that stuff. It works with Wavelink. All the software that works with the Elgato uh, Wave 3 will work with this. And I think it's gonna be fantastic. So I'm talking on my Wave 3, and we're gonna go ahead and bust this bad boy open and get it all set up. And when, you, when I come back, you're gonna be able to see and hear the difference. Now, first of all, let me uh, go ahead and open uh, these so I can just show you what they look like. And the Wave 3 microphone is becoming the most popular microphone on the market. You see it, everybody's got it now, right? Like it's the go-to microphone for anyone that wants to have professional sound. I'm struggling to do this without looking. Uh, I probably should have had these stickers off uh, beforehand, but <laughs> anyway, um, so right here, you've got this beautiful microphone, a uh, small form factor, which is kind of cool. No need for um, one of these right here. You're not, it's not a windscreen, it's a, you know what it is, I'm blanking. Um, but you don't need anything to kind of like block out uh, anything for the sound. So here it is right here, um, you know, to, to take away any of the, you know what I mean? Um, and this is it. We're going to attach it right here onto the, the uh, wave mic arm. Uh, this is the, the low profile. So that, like I was saying, there is a bundle on their website where you can get the wave XLR, uh, which is normally $159.99. Uh, so together, these two right here are about $160, which is about the price of the Wave, uh, the Wave 3. And you're getting the same type of setup, all right? But if you want, you can actually, you know, use this with any mixer that you want. Um, so yeah, there you go right there. So uh, <laughs> I love that it tells you, speak into this end, all right? So let's go ahead and set this microphone up and I'll show you uh, the Wave XLR, which is the same uh, form factor as the Stream Deck. So this is something that you could theoretically uh, set them up with side by side. All right, just gonna bring out the razor knife, make this so much easier, all right? Because I'm not gonna be able to show you this once I have it set up. So this connects USB to 
your PC, uh, kind of like uh, you would do with a mixer, uh, typically. So, of course, I am struggling to get it out of the package because it's all tight. Uh, there we go. All right. So, right here, you have the wave... Oh my God, I'm struggling with the packaging here. Okay, uh, the Wave XLR mixer. And on the back, you can see USB-C, it has a headphone jack and your XLR port, all right? And then you can turn you know, your volume control. Um, and then it's got all your, your different, um, you know, things that you can control right there. And it actually has a, a cover. I believe they're experimenting with covers that you can replace here. So, all right, let me go ahead and set this up and we are about to see the difference in this sound and the Wave uh, DX sound. So let's do this. All right, and we are back and you'll probably notice that there is a little bit more clarity, not necessarily a ton and I might be really loud right now. Um, I'm kind of working out everything. I have like literally all the pretty microphones like sitting in front of me, but um, I'm trying to like still, my desk is also a mess. Um, I'm still trying to figure out the best of everything. So the word I was looking for was pop filter. It has a pop filter built in. Uh, so this is a pro grade mic. All right. This is the best of the best. And like I said, you don't have to use the Wave XLR as a mixer. Uh, you could certainly go get a mixer, but keep in mind that there is the internal Wavelink software uh, that operates as a mixer. Uh, this microphone is pretty low profile. I mean, obviously it's a little different having like kind of a, a Canon mic. I know this looks awkward. Um, like kind of like a Canon style microphone instead of having these very pretty, you know, announcer kind of style mics. Like these are definitely amazing designs for a microphone. And, and this is too. It's just going to take some adjusting for me as far as uh, how everything operates. And obviously I can see it's still hitting yellow as I get further away. Um, so this is uh, just just a phenomenal microphone one thing to keep in mind is there is a bundle going on right now where you can get uh the wave the wave mic arm low profile i don't know how loud i am but this awesome mic arm uh the wave xlr the wave dx and uh, or a mini mount uh and you can add on an xlr cable you're getting like 70 dollars off it comes out to like 289 uh, for the package. So uh, this is the Wave DX. If you already have a mixer, like a hundred bucks and you've got yourself a pro level audio microphone. You know, this is the type of thing that's gonna compare with like the Shure microphones and, and microphones of that nature. Also 159 for the Wave XLR. And remember, if you don't have an XLR microphone, uh, they do have them on the site for 19.99. Um, I don't know what color it is, but red's my favorite color. So I got one off Amazon, uh, as well. So, uh, this is the Wave DX microphone. You're going to start seeing this in all my streams. If I'm a little loud right now, it's because I literally plugged it in and set it up. Okay. I did not change anything. I didn't change any filters. I've changed on the little dial. Like I've, I've raised and lowered, uh, the volume on the dial just to try to like see where it's at on my my uh, wave or my uh, Streamlabs OBS you know software and right now it's just pushing into the red a little bit so I don't know if I'm like high or if I'm low but this is a little bit of a sample of what this microphone is going to sound like and uh, I I didn't I could have gotten this a couple weeks ago. The reason why I didn't is because look at what I have, okay? I have these two microphones right here, and they're beautiful. And they're honestly 
as much as anyone necessarily needs, okay? The only reason that you're going to get this microphone is because you want to have a professional mix. You can use this in so many professional settings. This is like an announcer microphone. This is, you know, these, like, these right here are, are, are amazing for just sitting at your desk, you know, talking while you're playing video games, all that kind of stuff. You can use it in so many scenarios, but this is just that next level of audio, and that is what really attracted me to it. Um, it seems like it's going to be a really big priority for Elgato going forward. So when I kind of read that they really wanted to see people uh, using them and stuff like that, I said, you know what, I'm going to take you up on that offer. And uh, these are not going anywhere. I love these mics so much. This is like my high school colors. So like it was super cool and I had to have it. And then this one, I mean, who doesn't want a, a Hot Pockets microphone? So these are going to be just amazing display pieces like my beta unit that's right there. Uh, so thank you, Elgato, for sending me this way, sending this my way. And I, you're going to be hearing me use the Wave DX from now on. And uh, hopefully that just makes me sound that much better. I certainly need all the help I can get. Um, I will have a link in the description to this microphone on Elgato's website. And uh, if this is something that interests you, you can have professional grade audio for under $300 today. And uh, that's pretty crazy because I don't know if you've seen the price of some of these uh, Shure microphones and stuff like that. They are expensive. And uh, this is this is not cheap either by any stretch of the imagination, but, you know, it's, it's a great way to get into pro audio. Anyway, I hope this was helpful. I'm not the smartest person in the world. Um, I don't know everything, uh, but what I can tell you is, is my experience and, and how everything sounds. And we got a cameo from Thor over there. Um, and hopefully you can hear it, all right? Um, I, I think I'm the perfect person to talk about this in a lot of ways because I'm not an audio guy, you know, like I know what I hear and I know what's easy to use and how to set it up and, and all of those things. And this is so simple. It's so easy to set up. It's so easy to use, uh, that even a dummy like me can, uh, can do it and can hear the difference. Like, it's not like I'm going from, you know, playing for a division two college to the, you know, the Boston Red Sox, you know, like it's not that huge of a jump, but you know, it's kind of like the difference of, uh, you know, being on the Charlotte Hornets and then getting traded to the Boston Celtics, you know, you're in the NBA, but now you're on the best team in the world. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm just kind of talking some more. Uh, to see how this all sounds, and uh, we'll see it. Thanks, Elgato.